so I just kind of try to make people question what they know as beautiful. Whenever I introduce myself now, I usually start calling myself a visual artist and a performer. I used to introduce myself as a drag character, but then it still has a very old understanding of drag for most people. I just had brought a lot of Thai, like traditional Thai dancer accessories to Germany and then over the years of wearing it, one broke and I just had a piece of it in my hand and realized that I could just use that in a makeup and glue that onto my face. And I think that was quite, quite a significant part in actually creating that look or that vision because that shape of this one panel I then took into different makeups. A lot of trial and error things, a lot of happy accidents and that just coming together is always really, it's always really exciting. So then actually putting everything together in the end and seeing if it worked the way I wanted to is probably the most, the most exciting part. Well, I, I didn't start makeup with the approach of becoming a makeup artist or with the approach of becoming someone who would actually do makeup for a living. I kind of was thrown into it. I would still draw inspiration from the fashion design or for, from the pieces I would wear and then these would inspire me to do a makeup around them or to build a makeup around them. Reinvent the whole thing. I can reinvent one part of it but then keep the other aspects the same and it still reads as a character of my own. I think my favorite mud product at the moment would be the brow products. I found them very easy to work with. The cake liner is something I've always been a fan of and always been using in my work. Because it's just about precision and working with brushes and a liner, I find the consistency of it very helpful for my work. I'm, I'm just a very hard judge on myself, so I keep seeing my older looks and I'm already not liking many pieces about them. I don't know, I just want to see my work progressing. I don't want to see myself losing the old parts that really interested me in the first place. What keeps me going is actually creating, creating new and creating new characters. I mean, everything I learned is a first. Makeup does transform my personality, but it doesn't, it doesn't make me a different person. It definitely just encourages me to be more outgoing, to be more secure about, about me. I'm never inspired to share myself because I would never know what is actually interesting about me. Because to me it's normal, I just live in a very I live in a very specific bubble that other people can't relate to. If that's over, I'll, I'll find something new. 